Uh, you joining me on a little sojourn this morning from Baffle Creek. I'm here with Dinger from Murray Crab Fishing and Tronky. And uh, we're out having a bit of a look around before they get on the water. They're off having a bit of breakfast at the moment. So it's as good a time as any to get out and just check what's around. Look, see. Expecting the wind to get up, so I just want to get a bit of fishing done if I can. Could even just put a lure out the back while I push up upstream. Surprisingly deep here, actually. Sitting in about two meters of water. Expecting a bit of wind today. Uh, for the time being, it's not looking too bad. If it doesn't get up beyond this, I'd be really happy, but there's a fair chance we're going to run into a few problems a bit later with regards to being able to sit still. The tide's on its way out, so it seems like a good time to come and explore push downstream in a little bit when the boys have finished their breakfast. The water is so clear. I'm seeing the bottom pretty comfortably here in, now it's down to four feet. Whoops, stingrays just right here, stingrays. Came down for a bit of a fish from the bank last night and managed to get just the one pike. But at least I hooked up to something, which was good. It looks like there are fish sitting down very low. First up, I'll go on to the little Berkeley Shimmer Shad. See if that can heighten a little bit of activity. little rubbly sort of bottom by the looks of it. There we go, pretty sure that was a little hip. Not very big, but it was a hip. We're on. We're on to a tiny little brim, tiny brim, but we got one. No donut today. Hey little fella, take it easy. He's about the same size as my logo there. We have a fish for the day. May have shot him up the bum with that lure too, but anyway. Had a little tacker. That was a good hit. I missed it. Lovely little brim again. We're on. Not bad fish. <laughs> Good fish. Oh, are we a trevally or something? Not big, but enough to pull a bit of drag. Thankfully, we're in three meters of water. Yeah, trevally. 
No, no, good brim. Good brim bow. Yeah, good brim. Oh yeah. How'd you go, son? Oh yes. Good fish. One of the boys looks like they're heading up just now. There we go. Sweet. Soft vibe there. Nice little fish. Get a bit of an idea of just how big he is. There he goes, 30 centimetres. See you, mate. 30 centimetre brim. Pretty happy with that. And he gave a good, good account of himself too. So I had just worked up to this corner, thinking, oh, well, I'll change the lure. And I saw some fish underneath me and thought I'd just have to cast there. Could well be a jack down amongst these, so. A sandbar over to my right here. Water channeling through this area, so it seems like a good spot. Any luck? Yeah, just pulled in a brim, Did you? about 30. Yeah, nice. And I caught a little baby. No, it didn't take me long to catch the first little fella. Yeah, that's, that's the plan, just back that way. Yeah, I figured I'd come up here because I know there's a rock bar up here. I figure good spot for him to come around the corner there. Yep. So, um, I figured I'd have a look up here while you guys were having brekkie and maybe drift back down. It looks like there's quite a bit down here on the sounder, so. Yeah, you got a 3D scan, right? Oh, not 3D, but yeah, it's got side scan on it. But the main part is just your traditional sonar, picking up the smaller fish shapes. Any luck yet? Pardon? Any luck yet? I haven't had a duck. Ah, right. Got a couple? Yeah. Just brim. Yeah, um, did you still plan on drifting down to the current? Yeah, yeah, I just figured there's a rock bar here, I'll hit that while I was waiting for you. Yeah, sure. If you catch a jack, scream like a if you catch a jack, scream like a little schoolgirl. I probably will anyway. Yeah. <laughs> you you know if I catch a jack, don't worry about it. <laughs> I'll be all excited and then I have to come and change the jack. <laughs> ah, just rinse them over the side. What was that, sorry? Rinse them over the side. Boys are out trying to catch their first jack. That's what they're really keen on, especially Dinger. Tronky, I think he's keen on a flathead. And uh, uh, any chance of a flathead in here today?
that wind is getting really strong. And I think that's going to play all sorts of havoc with this fishing today, which is a real shame. Glad I've picked up one already because otherwise these conditions the donut could be in order. It's unbelievable to think that the water was like glass only an hour ago. And we're on. Chunky's on. Oh, giving a good fight. What is it? Ah, oh, nice. Got it. How do I keep fishing out of kayaks? Yeah. Like that. Beauty. Thank you. Because it's fun, that's how. There you go. Good little size too. Yeah, and I have a Come down. you have good teeth, don't you? Hey, Gangsway! Out of that wind, it's quite nice out here. But once you get up into that wind, oh gee, it's tough. You can see the boys are pushing up to a nice little rock bar or a rocky edge there now, so maybe even the mouth of a little creek. Got anything else? No. Nah. A couple of baby taps, and that's about it. Yeah, nice. Yeah, right. Yeah. 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 Chop's pretty bad over there. Yeah, not surprised. Yeah. That's why I'm sticking this side so it's a little bit protected. There we go, we're on. It's not big, but we're on to a fish. We're on to two fish, double header. Hey! A couple of little trevs sitting in the drift there. Goldens, perhaps with the stripes on them. Anyway, onto a fish. Nice little Moses perch. Quite a mangrove jack, but it's got some of the redness to it. There it goes. Hey little mate.
Whoa! We are on! Whatever it is, it's good. I've only got light lines, so I've got to take it easy. Whoa! That was just on a fast retrieve. We're on! Oh, this is good. Let's go. Come on. Trevally or something maybe. Queenfish. Oh. Don't break off. Trevally it'll be. Bad queen here either. Queenie, it went off. No jumping, but um, not bad little one. Yeah, bad at all. <laughs> yeah. loads of bait there. Heaps of bait. It need to be legal, wouldn't it? Uh. I think legal is about 50, so I don't think you'll quite get there. Oh, well, mate. Oh, well, I suppose technically he does. Ooh. Oh, yeah. Tyler's got a pair of fork on him. Yeah. He's 52. So. There we go. This nice little queen fish on a soft vibe. A lot of bait sitting on the point and a little quick retrieve and it just went mental. Did you go on the soft Yeah. Ha! <laughs> baby is the baby queenies. Don't do that. Just here. Turtle just here. He is massive. He's huge. Here he comes. Look at him. Look at him. What a beast.
And of course it's on the little line, little lure. Whoa! It's going high. It's not huge, but... Whoa, whoa, whoa! A little turf maybe. Yeah, a little trevally I think. Yeah, that's it. A little trev it is. There we go, buddy. Oh yeah! It has been really hard work today, really hard work. But we may need another fish. Nice little GT. Nice little fish. Not huge, but big enough for me to try and handle on that line. On the light rod. 39 centimetre Trevally. Very nice. See you, mate. Lot of solid shoulders on him. What have we got? Going over the flats there. Fair chance you're dealing with a flatty. Didn't really pull any drag to begin with, so. Yeah, a little fluffy. Well, not a bad one, actually. Hasn't really done much in the way of pulling just yet, so. There he goes. He's just spending more time shaking than anything. Not a bad size, buddy. There we go, flathead. Yo, beauty. All right, very dark looking flathead. Wow, check out the colors on it. Right up in the weed, up in here, a lot of weed up in here. Look at the beautiful color of that thing. Nice flatty. Nice flathead. The win for the Greedy Guts lure. There is a massive turtle up here. It is huge. Nice little fish. Nice little fish. Oh, that might be turtle baiting. Could be too. Check this out. Check this out.
That's a big looking fire. Big looking fire up there. or something. Looks like the fire's on the other side of the river. A hug. This wind has been pretty horrific trying to come up there. It's uh, blowing its backside off to be fair. I've just pushed across to the calm side of the creek just to see if I can get a bit of respite and get a few metres before I uh, tire too much. Now that it's a bit calmer in this stretch, I'm just trolling a couple of hard body lures. him well it's been a pretty long and tough sort of day on the water the wind continues to be very difficult certainly managed to get a couple of fish each which has been really good um, should have a little bit of fish for dinner which is also good just dropped another fish only a few minutes ago after an awful lot of casts. Hooked him up on this Zerg fish trap. Wasn't overly large though. I dropped him before I could get it in. couple of little hits on that Oop. there we go we're on it's not a right fish it's all right oh, we've got some weed on there too what are we a trev or something A good little fight. Yeah, a little trev. A couple of little whacks before I hooked up. There you go. Well, I suppose that's technically trev number four for the day. After hooking two at once earlier. Maybe they're just starting to switch on and that'll keep me keen to keep casting, I don't know, but all right little fella, didn't give you much chance did I? He's a fat little fella too. Has a nice little trev on the Zeric fish trap. Alright little mate. 
See ya. Don't grow bigger.